melanin build up impurities that's going to seriously affect the blood flow and also your hair growth so adding Hey, so what's going on? Super excited for this video. If you are new to my channel, welcome to my channel. I'm so glad you are here. I'm a cosmetic chemist specializing in natural hair care, and I'm here to help you understand your hair and products, ingredients, and all of the things from a cosmetic chemist perspective. And I also help entrepreneurs start hair care lines as well. And today, in this video, we are talking about how to improve, how to improve your scalp circulation for hair growth. Okay, that's the introduction. You guys know I always any time. Let's get started. Okay, so when it comes to scalp circulation and how it facilitates hair growth, a lot of it has to do with the blood vessels within our scalp that are connected to our follicle. Now, in a perfect scenario, we have blood that carries oxygen and hormones and amino acids and nutrients and vitamins and all of the things that helps to facilitate healthy growing hair. Now, in some cases, our scalp may experience a lack of circulation, and this can be due to poor diet, dehydration, smoking, and a number of other factors. But in this video, I wanna share a few external factors that you can start doing even today to help improve your scalp circulation, okay? So let's start off with number one. Okay, number one is going to be Rossel clay. And Rossel clay is an amazing natural clay that contains a high amount of silica. And silica alone is just amazing for strengthening our hair. Now, Rossel clay naturally has detoxifying properties. So it removes excess oil, impurities, toxins from the scalp and also from the hair. That's going to seriously affect the blood flow and also your hair growth. So adding Rossel clay to your hair, your scalp in this case for this video is gonna help tremendously with improving the scalp circulation. And of course, you guys know I will put step-by-step -step instructions on how to incorporate this into your hair care regimen in the description box below. Okay, number two for scalp circulation is going to be thyme and cedar wood. These essential oils, so amazing. Now, thyme naturally has an antioxidant within it called thymol. Now, thymol is amazing for reducing free radical damage, and free radical damage that comes from the sun and other environmental pollutants within the air tend to disrupt our hair growth cycle, which typically is tied to lack of oxygen and lack of blood flow to the scalp. So, oxidative stress is no joke. But with thyme having such that amazing antioxidant within it, thymol is a great way to reduce free radical damage and reduce oxidative stress to help improve your scalp circulation. Now on the flip side with cedarwood essential oil, it's great for balancing oil production. If you have too much oil production, sebum on your scalp, that can lead to buildup. But cedarwood oil is known for reducing that buildup to help promote better scalp circulation. And together, thyme and cedarwood essential oil behave very similar to peppermint and rosemary where they are actual natural stimulates to actually promote blood flow to the scalp to promote hair growth. And then the last thing I want to mention about promoting scalp circulation is going to be regular washing and scalp exfoliation. Now this may seem like a no-brainer, however, if you dismiss your scalp and don't give it the attention that it needs, you're going to get excessive dandruff, product buildup, oil buildup. Ideally, you want to get into a routine of cleansing your hair on a regular basis. For me, I do this once a week. I try not to go longer than two weeks. You also want to incorporate massaging with your shampoo. And you can even add a few drops of these essential oils, thyme, cedarwood to your shampoo to once again help promote that scalp circulation. And then the last thing I want to mention too is doing scalp exfoliating with an actual scrub or even like a scalp, you know, exfoliating brush would be ideal as well because that does help to break up any type of dead skin cells, excess dead skin scales, any type of excess product buildup on the scalp. That scrub will help to break that up. That massaging is going to help to dilate your blood vessels so you get even better blood flow to your your scalp to once again improve your scalp circulation. All right guys, we've enjoyed this video and learned something new. Once again, if you enjoyed this video, please be sure to like this video and to stay in the loop for more curly chemistry content, be sure to subscribe to this channel, hit the bell, location bell to stay in the loop for more curly chemistry content. And of course, I do have a question for you. What is one thing that you do for your scalp? on a monthly or on a weekly basis. Maybe you do scalp exfoliation. Maybe you do a scalp rinse. Maybe you do scalp massages. What is that one thing, your favorite thing to do when it comes to your scalp? Comment below, let us all know, and I cannot wait to have the conversation with you. And for those who are asking about hair care coaching, yes, my calendar is open. It is officially open. So if you do want to connect with me one-on-one -on -one about your hair, where I can create a customized regimen for you, including different techniques that are best for your hair type, including product recommendations, customized hair care plan, all the things, I 
will post more information for you below in the description box. If you enjoyed this video and you want to learn more about your hair, check out this amazing ebook I created just for you. My best advice are in these ebooks from the best ingredients for your hair, the best techniques for your hair to overcome dryness, hair loss, all of the things you will find in these ebooks. And I'll post the link below for you with more information in the description box. And if you're ready to start your hair care line, no matter where you are in the world, I would love to connect with you one on one. And of course, I'll post more information below for you in the description box. All right, guys, I love and I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.